Hey, Slick, it's me. <laughs> what the fuck do you want? You got my money, punk? Hey, you got some coconut water or something like that? I need some electrolytes. Damn, it's kind of warm, isn't it? <sighs> Man, you got a death wish or something. Am I supposed to kill you now? Oh, no, bro. Not me. No. Nah. Oh, yeah. But that's my boy. Yeah, but that's my boy. He has betrayed everyone he's ever known. He's got you involved with the federal government, and he's messed up several business ventures of mine. He has got to go. And you know what? I'd like to say that this isn't personal, but it is personal. But the feds, man. The feds have told me to kill Trevor, and I obviously can't kill them both. The feds. Steve Haynes, Dave Norton. I own shopping malls. I would not employ those two clowns in. And I make one phone call, their careers, they are over. So you're going to A, listen to some 50 grand a year pension hunter, or B, a billionaire, who even the president lets finger his wife, or C, Try and be really stupid and save those two idiot mentors of yours and have everybody in the goddamn state crawling up your ass. A, B, or C. Time's ticking, pal. Beep, beep, beep. And your answer is... Man, you know what? Man, fuck you. Genius answer, pal. Total genius, but time is running. You think about it. Me, I got a triathlon coming up, and I am in deep training. Bye bye Man, fuck you. So I really do have to pick something. Uh, what? Why would I want to kill either of those? Obviously you want to go with Death Wish. Let's do it. Franklin? Lester, dog. Man, we need to talk. I got a problem I need your help with. Man, actually, fuck it. Man, we all got a problem you can help us with. Calm down, all right? Come to my house. All right, I, all right, I'm coming. So, I didn't know what the ending mission was going to be like, but now I can see why everybody... I didn't, like, I didn't read any spoilers, but people were saying choose option C, which, after seeing the options, I mean, why, why would you choose otherwise? Hey, I need a cab. Not a problem. A driver's on the way. All right, thank you. All right, let's get it marked. Let's get it marked. I probably don't even have to uh, mark it each time. I probably can just choose L. I'm going to put it to the test. I'll choose waypoint, then I'll actually slide over. Come on, where's that cab at? Look at these text messages from the gun store. Got, got cabs in my phone. Bullets through text messages. Let's see if it actually has it on there. Well, yeah, you got to go through like 50 things to get there. Jesus. All right, so we're back at Lester's place. Problem is, I have no idea what's about to happen. What's the panic, bro? What the fuck do you think? Man, imagine a fucking scenario that will fuck things up the worst. Boy, my mind is just racing. But, you know, I don't want to say something that's really exciting and then you have to act all deflated and say, no, no, it's just that somebody got the same tattoo I got. So why don't you just go ahead and tell me? Some motherfucker wants me to kill Michael. Some other motherfucker wants me to kill Trevor. I feel I can't kill both of them. Man, I'm fucked, man. I don't know what the fuck to do right now. Damn. Well, I can see that. Who are the motherfuckers? <sighs> Steve Haynes, uh, this angry motherfucker from the FIB. Yeah. Um, Devin Weston, man, you know the... Um, oh, that angry, that, um, rich fucker from whatever hole he hibernates in. Exactly. All right, all right. I say kill Michael, then kill Trevor. Oh. Man, are you for real? You're fucked, you know? I, I, I don't know. You know everything, dog. I know, okay? But I, I, I'm sorry. I guess this is it. You know, I'm doing my best, man. I don't know how you can deal with both of them. I know, man. Shit. We're fucked. Every single one of us is fucked. Unless... Okay. Steve Haynes is under a lot of heat because of the shootings at Court Center. 
And Devin Weston is A, known to be a major asshole, and B, known to be friendly with Don Percival, who runs Merriweather. I think, actually, Weston owns a piece of Merriweather. Right, 11%. Pretty good for a pseudo-liberal owning a private army. So, they would both love to be involved in capturing the bullion that we just lifted. If I tell them both that you boys are at the foundry and where you had heights melting it down, then maybe, maybe both of them will pay you a visit and bam, we turn it into a, a bust. I ain't got no better ideas. All right, I'm gonna get in touch with Michael and Trevor. You go to the foundry, get yourself set up. I got you. What's up, homie? Man, things are kind of fucked up right now, dawg. It's all good, nigga. Who better to have in a fucked up situation than a fucked up fool like me? Man, that's what the fuck I wanted to hear. Hey, look, I'm coming to your crib to get your ass. I'm here. I'm about to show up on this, this little bike. It's the manly man stuff right there. So if I have to pick him up, I probably should get something that's actually going to be worth, worth driving. Anything else, I'll probably get killed. <laughs> trying to drive anything. You know what? I, I kind of like driving this more than anything else in the game, though. Oh, shit. Until that happens. Until it happens. You know what? Fuck this. Let me get this Mini Cooper right here, and I will be fine. See, Rich? This is what I'm talking about. All right, we made it. Isn't it time you tried Ego Chaser and took things to the limit? Where are we going? We are uh, heading to the foundry place. Kite surfing, sand surfing, free climbing, helicopter parkour, wingsuit flying, big wave surfing, snowmobile accidents, triathlons, triathlons. Hey, look, hear me out, man. If it's too heavy for you, you can back out. No drama. Hit me with it. Man, we got a real problem, dog. My boys, man. Well, we trying to save them. You actually doing something for your homies for a change? Hell yeah, I'm in. Who wanna clap your homies? Who don't, nigga? These Chinese dudes, some FIB cats, the rich white asshole who scammed us on them cars. Devin Weston? That punk bitch? Why didn't you say we was creeping on him? We ain't creeping on him, nigga. At least I don't think he gonna be there. We gotta take all the heat he can throw at us before we worry about how we coming back on his ass. But you is coming back, right? Oh, hell yeah, we creeping on that fool. Oh, so you ain't the mercurial motherfucker you frontin' ass, huh? Man, I'm just trying to make something out of myself, dawg. That don't change who my homies are, nigga. It don't change my family. Look, man, Mike and Trevor, they should be inside. Can you stay out here and let us know when the bad dudes is coming? I got it, man. I'll let you. So what's supposed to happen, exactly? I'm, I'm kind of confused a little bit. Okay, I know where we are now. Okay. This could be it. Our showdown with a private army. And you're bringing a rifle? Yeah, I'm bringing a rifle. It's a good gun. It'll get the job done. Hey, man, what the fuck am I doing risking my ass trying to save y'all ass if you just gonna kill each other? Hey, you're not saving me. You're saving him. Ah, oh, you're saving this fat fuck. Man, y'all gotta keep y'all fucking heads right and end this shit. If not, man, I'll put bullets in both of you motherfuckers. Hey, they here? I know them when I see them, homie. They creep. All right, good. Y'all hear that? Now, if we doing this shit, man, it's either now or never. Come on, Trevor. Fuck it! Where do you want me? All right, man. You go over there. All right, where you want me? You hold your position right there. Okay. I'm gonna go over there. How can you not like Trevor? You Here's know. Building. Watch your stecker. Chill, dog. You gotta wait. Ambush him. Uh, with what? Oh, 
I don't know, guys. Yeah, bitch. Oh, shit. Come on, you punk. I should have just shot that in the first place. So I guess the other two endings, you get there and you kill one or the other. Oh, shit. Come on, get up there, get up there. See, as a sniper rifle, it works out. He always seems to have the sniper. Headshot, bitch! Come on, Trevor! Let's finish this. Oh, okay, here they are. So you got the, you got the FIB, you got everybody's been, Jesus. Fucking it, come on. You would almost assume they're all working together against us. They don't know who they're fucking with. Go to Lamar, okay. Now, how exactly am I supposed to get over there without getting killed? Where where did he go anyways? Like, like Lamar was supposed to come in with us, but I think he's just going to hang back for a second. Because you know they're about to Don't ambush us again. Long. Look at this shit. Ow. Fucking A, come on. I got to hop down. Can I hop down right here? Fuck it, here we go. <laughs> Whatever works, man. Sometimes you just gotta jump off shit and hurt yourself. LD, just hold on, I'll be there. All right, here we go. Coast is clear. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Fuck, homie, I'm trying to get to you. Hey, these the fools picking on you. There you go. It wouldn't be right if I didn't have to save your ass just one. Save me? Nigga, I just wanted some company. Good look, yo. Oh shit, that thing in the back's about to pop. There it goes. Back off, my nigga, bitch. Team, Jesus, keep your head Team, come in. Right. Frank, I think T's in trouble. This is FIB team where I last saw him and he ain't responded. Man, I gotta stay out here with Lamar. Can you get to him? Shit. Thanks, man. All right, here we go. Fine. I'll try and find him. Headshot, bitch. Oh, shit. There we go. So I'm supposed to just go Say back something. and forth, but... Trevor! Get some cover. Uh, oh. uh, this war's on our side, homies! Can you stop being an asshole, please? Where you at, Ben? Where you at? There you are, you dick! What was the problem? I took a knock. I was sitting out a few rounds. It's good to know you care. Yeah, well, don't do it again. Watch out! Another FIB team on the way! There's so many of them! Jesus! I'm swapping to Trevor so I can use his rage. The rage mode he has. You know what? Fuck it. Here we go. Oh! Straight beast mode, this bitch! Let's go, let's go, let's go. 
So we're all for about to be walking down the street shooting cops and shit. I guess the the objective is to kill everybody in the gun. city. The building. Absorb the pressure, people. They can't sustain this. Oh shit. If I keep shooting, maybe something will explode. I don't know. Look at all the dots on the other side. Jesus. We're ready for ya. Come on. Where is this guy at? Uh oh, back up, back up. I like how uh, Frank Franklin's still wearing the tuxedo and all that shit. Or the suit, excuse me. You know what you're dying for, bud? Guy, I have the rage meter built pretty high. It's over for you, bitch! Where's this last guy? Hiding behind a tire like a bitch. We're looking okay. Let's regroup with the main set of doors. I don't think there's anybody left in the city. So, huh? Oh. What's up? Huh? What's next? Huh? We're just gonna wait around for someone to kill us, or are we gonna wait till this fucker gets turned oh, again, huh? Fight me. Ain't anybody getting turned again, and you know it. Hey man, the way I see it. We only just begun to clean this shit up. We got a lot of old friends I think need to be re-educated. A lot of friends. I mean, things could get really messy. No, we just got to silence a few noisy people. <laughs> what the hell, yo? Let me see. There's, uh... Steve Haynes. Dave Norton. No, we need him alive. Why? So nobody fucks with us afterwards. What about that tribe, motherfucker? The one that think you two boys is dating? Shit, you know he bound to come back. Yep, there's that. Well, who's the uh, the guy who set up Lamar? Hmm? Stretch, we want to throw him in? Shit, Trevor will throw anyone in just to satisfy his bloodlust. Whoa! Hey, it's called a fucking loose end, all right? Now, if we're going to be men of peace and tranquility, we tie up loose ends. <sighs> Man, Stretch has been a liability. But then we're going to have to take care of our old pals Devin Weston and Steve Haynes. Oh, fuck, what a mess, man. Well, let's get it cleaned up. How about you get Lester on the line? This. Uh, stop calling this number. Hey, it's me, dawg. <laughs> You're alive. I thought someone might have your phone. No, nah, no, nah, but look, I got you on speakerphone. Oh, did Mike make it? Yeah, I'm here. And the other one? <clears throat> See you putting the ground wheels. Uh-huh. You, um, just calling for a chat? No, we got some work to do. Can you get us some whereabouts? Oh, I'll do my best. Who? Steve Haynes to start. And Devin Weston's ass. And, uh, Wei Ching. W-E-I-C-H-E-N-G. Wei Chang. Wei Chang. And Franklin's pal, Stretch. Huh, Stretch? Yeah, man, look, his real name is Harold Joseph. Okay, well, I can tell you that Agent Haynes is taping a show over on Del Perro Pier. Shooting permit came up immediately. Check it! Oh, I wanted to ice that fucker since the moment I met him. All right, all right. Ah, I got a signal from Mr. Harold Joseph's phone over at the B.J. Smith Recreation Center. No, I got him. I got him. Let's keep him clear of uh, known associates. All right, thanks, dawg. You got it. What you got for me? Tao Ching's credit card just bought a Magnum at the beach club in Pacific Bluffs. Okay, I'll go ask his ass about his punk-ass dad. When I find Mr. Weston, I'll send the coordinates. All right, good. So we're really going and being a cleanup crew. That is so badass. What a way to end the game, right? We made our plans. Let's stick to them. We take out our assigned targets. Any deviation will lead to confusion and probably failure. We got one shot at this, guys. All right, let's do this shit. You know, I was like, yeah, you really... You got to pull a Walt from Breaking Bad and just kill everybody. Like the end of the mid-season 5 finale or whatever. All those people getting shanked in prisons within like three minutes. 
or something ridiculous. I don't know what it was. So realistically, this last mission is like a multi-part one, so. But you know, this kind of makes up for some of the other missions that were like either incredibly short, like going and getting like five different things for that one heist counted as a mission, I think. I don't really know if it did, actually. It, it could have. I don't know. Some, sometimes it'll say mission pass, but nothing happens. But I do want to say thank you guys so much for sticking with me. This is essentially the longest series I've ever had. Just the main story, at least. I'm trying to think something else that might have come close. Like, Far, Far Cry 3 was a great one. That was only like 50-something parts, and I did side missions. So, I don't know. Hey, Lamar. That was above and beyond, homie. Ain't nothing above and beyond when it comes to the homies, homie. <laughs> a nigga just want to be helpful, you heard me? I'm serious, dawg. That's hood. Mike and Trevor, too. We great. You a real homie, and I love you, dawg. You too, homie. You done with this bullshit now? Almost. A couple loose ends. Aw, oh, shit. I know that voice. You creeping on some fools, huh? All right, nigga, we'll handle your candle. Lay low, my nigga. Wow, really? Did I just kill him instantly? So a second ago, there was this weird glitch. I think he's dead. the triads okay so a minute ago I was yeah like I didn't have my gun for saying it's so weird you know what we should be fine I'm just gonna drive as fast as I can hey I got out clean you dudes ain't gonna have no more triads coming out we ain't gonna have anyone to sell super weapons to either but hey ho who's up we still gotta do stretch and agent all right, Trevor it is. Bring down Haynes, okay. See, he, he doesn't have any weapons either. I don't know what it is. I'm moving on Haynes. Les, see if you can patch me into his radio mic. I want a last reminder of what an annoying prick he is. Los Santos. A city of saints. A city of sinners. And nothing in between but the FIB. Cut! God, this is crap. Who writes this bullshit anyway? Okay, all right. You got this framed right? <clears throat> yeah, you're looking great. Is the chin? How's the chin? Oh, sharp. All right, the audio's clean? Nice. So, well, say something. Uh, check, check, check. Yeah, it's great. Okay, fine. We're on. I'm ready. You ready? Speed. All right, let's do this, people. I'm a professional. Let's go. <clears throat> Hi, I'm Steve Haynes. Hi. This is Los Santos. Reality. <gasps> oh, my God. Yeah, bitch. Guy, that's his name. He shot him. Oh shit! Time to bail, time to bail. Oh! <laughs> For no reason. That'd be crazy if I get eaten by a shark. Since it's yet to happen. You know? I'm just gonna float in the water for a minute. That's safe to do, right? Let's get off this. I'll just stand here until it's all over, guys. Then I'll swap to Michael, and I'll take care of his part. He has to keep his family safe, at least, you know? Hey! 
Hey, Lester, I dealt with Haynes. You got a location on Devin Weston yet? Yeah, yeah, I do. The Merriweather team was dispatched to protect him in his house in the Tongva Hills. I say house, it's more of a... Yeah, 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 whatever. I'll go up there and get him. So who we got, man? Harold Stretch Joseph. Still outstanding. I'm taking care of him. This is the Michael thing. I think after this, we're all going after Devin together, maybe? Hey, Lamar and Franklin send their best. Oh shit. Who's this? He's dead. Oh, he's not. Escape the ballers. Time to go. I'm just going to drive until uh I get too far away. We're good to go. It's not it's not like the cops where you have to really like Oh shit, they're actually gaining on me. Okay, we should be fine. I'm clear. Your pal Stretch? He ain't a problem no more, Frank. Shit, he wasn't my pal. He was a dude who tanked us, homie. Thanks. So who we got, man? Go to Devin's house. Oh, this is about to be good. This is about to be good, guys. Oh, yeah. Thank you guys so much. I hope you enjoyed the finale of this series. The last several missions have been the best ones in the game. So, they really did save everything for the last. Hey, unless you got news from the Foundry team, I don't want to be disturbed. Kidnap Devin, holy shit, guys. It's about to go down. So you can't kill him. But you can kidnap him. Enemy operative in the vicinity! What the fuck? Where the fuck are the rest of them? The auto wave just doesn't take over sometimes. Alright, fuck this. Rage. Rage mode. I'm set. I'm a walk in combat situation, assholes. Take that shit. Oh shit. I just. Man, the rage meter just goes nuts. Damn it! Pays our is it bulletproof glass? Yeah, it is. I'm getting kind of bored of killing you, pricks. Here we go. What do you mean, all our operatives are dead? Where did he go? Oh, he's in there, wait, really? Wait, hear me out. Ugh. No more talking. Probably the last drive of this game. We are on it, guys. Hall boy's in the trunk. He's about to meet I got his Mr. Maker. Weston. Let's take him out of the city. Make him disappear. Meet me on the cliff off the GOH, Chiliad Mountain State Wilderness. You know, you're a, you're a resourceful guy to impact those train killers. I need someone like you in my organization. The CEO position's gonna be vacant real soon, Slick. I've got nothing against you, apart from the obvious hygiene issue. Michael caused me problems, so Michael had to go! You're looking at it rationally! 
There are people who are useful to you and people who ain't. And the people who ain't gotta go. Me? I'm not rational. I don't care if you're useful or not. I feel like taking you out, Devo. So that's what I'm doing. This is a serious offer. Work for me, you'll have everything you'll ever wanted. All I've ever wanted is to watch you drift in and out of consciousness as you're slowly disemboweled. Yes, yes, that's the kind of creativity I need on my team. Come on, come on, let me out of here. Look, I got my own company, Trevor Phillips Industries. Oh, yeah, a, a fellow entrepreneur. Let me buy a stick and give you money to grow. I don't know if you heard, but I'm kind of gold rich right now, so you got precisely nothing to offer. Prepare for the end, my friend. You crazy bum! Man, okay. So, driving around, you really get a good, like, tour of the city. This is why people want to kill you! You won't shut up! Oh, we're going all the way out here, okay. I was wondering where exactly this is going to take place at. I do like this car. Look at the little reflection of the lights on the cars. So small things in this game that make it perfect. That, you know, like the graphics, everything else is smooth. I don't know, if I, if I have to give this game an honest review. You can't do this to me! This is why the people I put in my trunk are usually dead. Whoa! I don't know, it's it's hard to rationalize not giving this game the highest score of any game you've ever get. You know, like it's there's so much to offer, it's a good story, unless you just don't like Grand Theft Auto games. It's a 10, you know? It's got a fantastic story. What the hell? Really? Find a happy place, you Zen cock! Why was that guy shooting me? Because I bumped into him? That's like the natural response of anybody in this game. The 18 others going mock speed next to me. Jesus. Really? Some, some bikers are going to give me trouble this state in the game? That makes no sense to me. Don't meditate, you phony prick! Whoa! Here we are, Slick. A few minutes for some one-on-one -on -one time. Tea? Never better, amigo. Good. Franklin? I'll be here. <coughs> Franklin. Hey, right, what's up? I assume you got him? Ooh, safe and sound. Ain't that right, buddy? <laughs> hey, my bad, homie. I picked C. Ain't that a bitch? You know, Devin, the way I see it, and hey, I'm no intelligent businessman like you, but the way I see it, there's two great evils that bedevil American capitalism of the type that you practice. Number one is outsourcing. You paid a private company to do your dirty work for you, and then you underpaid that company because you thought you were big enough and bad enough that you didn't have to play by the rules. Oh, number two. Offshoring your profits. Offshoring? Oh, it's horrible. You wouldn't want to be sent offshore just to save a little money, would you, T? Oh, no, Franklin? I wouldn't. Oh, no, I ain't would going nowhere. No, see, but we know your opinions on the matter, Devin. Keep your problems the fuck out of America, huh? <laughs> In this instance, when he puts it like that, it makes sense. Of course it does. Hey, Devin, goodbye, my old friend. Thanks for all the advice. Bye-bye. Oh shit, we're really doing it. Alright guys, worst way to die, go. I think drowning has to be one of them.
<sighs> so now what? Now we keep a low profile and get on with our lives. As friends. Well, do I have a choice? No, not really. All right, then. As, uh, flawed, awful, totally uncomfortable, and poorly matched friends. Absolutely. Oh, that's perfect. Then we can get back to the kind of capitalism we practice. Shit, I don't know how much more better that is than Devin's con. Ooh, hypocrisy, Franklin. Civilization's greatest virtue. Jesus, your therapist has a lot to answer for. I know, I still hate myself. But hey, at least I know the words for it now. Yeah, but I hate you, and I know the words for it. So does that mean I don't have to go to therapy? Look, man, you two motherfuckers terrify me of that middle age. I'm good. You're right to be afraid, Franklin. Yeah. Be very afraid, Franklin. <laughs> Tell you one thing, T. I'm getting too old for this nonsense. Oh. Wow, all right. To live or die in Los Santos. Well, I want to say thank you guys so much for making this a huge series for my channel. Uh, all the subscribes, all the subscribe, all the subscriptions, all the likes, favorites, comments. Uh, you guys are awesome. Honestly, if you've watched up to this point, you could probably give your own opinion on the game. So mine really doesn't matter. I thought it was a great game. Was it perfect? I don't think any game is ever 10 out of 10. For a Grand Theft Auto game, it's 10 out of 10. Everybody gave Grand Theft Auto 4 10s, but this is better than that. So I don't really know how people really do the math. Uh, this was the best Grand Theft Auto game that they've made so far, obviously. I think each one surpasses the last one. Uh, but with that being said, thank you guys so much for the support. And I'll be doing some side missions occasionally. Uh, some little fun videos for you. But I hope you enjoyed the story. And with that being said, you guys stay classy and take it easy.